Hello and welcome to another episode of the free to play and we are doing the event what we got going on here we're gonna open up the event browser active events and we have the trick or treat faction play and quick play I did a whole long stream on Monday yesterday it is Halloween night tonight and so I figured we'll play some mech warrior we are 25 matches in and we have to get 25 out of 100 here and then we have to get 50 well, we'll probably be scouting matches here because playing uh, invasion matches for 50 would take a very long time. But we are going to do it. I'm going to have to play a, a lot every single night and probably do some very long streams over next weekend as we do have nine more days to complete this. And uh, we're going to do it. But the good thing about it is that I'm going to be playing a bunch, but also we have some premium time cooking. Not only do we have the premium time from the uh, active premium time, uh, what is that, the, the, the banked premium time. The last patch, they delayed the patch by a day, and they gave everyone two days of premium time. So I activated that before I streamed yesterday, and that gave us a few days. But also, we got a few days from opening these loot bags, and also, on our recent events, we still have another three days here from the first one of the day, from the weekend warrior quick play challenge that we haven't claimed yet we have seven more days to claim so i'm tempted to claim this here three days of active premium time and we have five days and 18 hours of active premium on the free-to-play account so in this grind to get an additional well, we got 115 total rated done 25 so we have 125 matches left in order to get this event done and get that free mech with the SIBO bonus which is the most important thing for the free to play is it'll be the first time I've ever had a mech with a SIBO bonus on a free to play account we have to grind our ass off for it but we have premium time and we have the means to do it and I'm going to make several videos and also grind a lot off camera and on streams but for now we're gonna go with a design that I actually haven't run in the series since episode 22, 23, something around there. So a while ago, it is the 4ER medium laser two Gauss rifle night gear. And when you have to perform per match, you just have to guaranteed get your 100 match score in. This thing will do it. Practically one alpha strike, or no, not that little, it's a little overbearing there, but you can get your 100 match score in ridiculously fast with this mech it has some great damage output and we're gonna use it to uh, do some good stuff so let us get into some matches with our night gear and for our first match we are on skirmish and HPG manifold and we are going to immediately head for the front go my slow night gear mechiness 69.7 not that fast but just enough to get me into the battlefield. All right, let us look for some opponents. If I had pre-charged and just thrown out a slug there, I probably could have hit something. Uh, I do have 90 rounds, which is honestly too much. Really, it's too much. Uh, I put that many rounds on here because I actually used this mech last in like um, <laughs> faction play where I just stood back and just volleyed um, Goss rounds from the distance. Ooh, that guy didn't like that. Took that Goss right into his right torso. And, uh, caused some good damage. We've got these people moving on the left flank. I don't like this. I want to be with my team, but my team's rotating right. Oh. You get down from there. Only one of those hit. Get out of here, little shadow cat. Yeah, he dropped. Okay, good. New target acquired. Target spotted. Some good damage on that guy. Ooh, I actually shot his head. Ooh, there might be a possibility for it to head cap that guy. Panther, Doctor Guppy, watch yourself. Although he is going for my leg, he is doing probably one of the correct things, but he is a. Uh, attacking me in my weak spot my mobility I'm already slow 
Make me slower. But let us use our jump jets here. Pound that shot into that catapult A1. He is not going to get away before we are able to pound in another and end his life. Excellent. Ooh, this guy. Boom, got him. The four LRM-20 supernova. A nice hit into the blackjack on his right torso. Did, not, did that not hit him? I thought that hit him, but I guess it didn't. All right, we're going to move a little bit right here. We're going to move up, because we can. We're going to do a little bit of uh, jump spinnies, but it turned out to be not enough height. Come on. There we go. Boom. He did. Moving forward. This supernova will not survive my push. Oh, ooh, there's people here, too. Well, hello, Mr. Blackjack. I enjoy putting goss rounds into you. And also, oh, there's another Blackjack. And who are you jump jetting? You are a shadow cat, which took some goss in the legs. Oh, they've got a UAV above me. Well, that's okay. It's not like they can actually do anything with that UAV. Some of them are underneath, some of them are up top. Let's double back here. And let's head this way. We are 5 1. Things are looking excellent for our team. They won't expect this, Mr. Little Panther. You, you bastard. God damn, that Panther has a little armor. You won't survive everything, though. Oh, here comes that Lerms. Oh, dear God. Okay, that's blocking the Lerms, at least. There goes one torso. We managed to land another Goss round onto that Panther. If he comes for me, we can still probably take him out. We're good. We got a Goss rifle and three meds. Oh, he's got to get around here. Oh, which way is he going to go? I'm going to have one little shot here. Whoop! Missed it. I probably shouldn't have been uh, zoomed in there. Because then I wasn't able to see my target because the map got in the way. But I will certainly drop for you. Left leg critical damage. Left leg crit. That's okay. Question is, where did he go? Did he run on through to the other side? Or did he hide? Oh, hello. You're dead. <laughs> With one last Goss rifle straight into that CT, I believe. We take him out, and we succeed in our first match. We're at 26 now. 502 damage, 274... 274, 247. A little dyslexia there. 1,000 C-bills. That 82,000 bonus from the premium time. It's going to be so nice during all this grinding and 4,000 experience, but off to the next match. And for our next match, we are on Crimson Straight Skirmish. <laughs> we have some people recognizing us here in the chat. Well, you guys are on the video, so excellent. <laughs> Be gentle, maybe. Don't think this night here does gentle. Maybe does a, a little bit of a, a tickle, and then it just gives you that great big, you know, right hook of the pair of Goss rifles in your face. But let us move forward here. We're going to get on top of the Echo 5, a Fox 5 platform. It's pretty standard for the Crimson straight uh, fights. You can always start high and quite easily drop down low if you need to. So that's what we're going to do. Uh, we do want to have a little bit of a, an eye on our left in case there's a light that tries to flank us through Delta 5 real quick. Um, somebody, say, trying to shoot our backs as we were walking up this ramp here. Uh, not much we can do about it except just be cognizant of it. Just know that it can happen, and if it, we start taking damage, that's why. Because there is a light in Delta 5 shooting at us. But things are looking good. We're going to get up, and I'm feeling good about it. Yeah, don't see anybody over there. We should be good. We did get around here without taking any damage. We did get that one light spot at the saddle, which may or may not mean that they're going for saddle. 
it could just be a guy poking. But we want to do is get organized and everything together. <laughs> what has this guy done? He's got splooges all over his mech. Oh, you look awesome, dude. <laughs> oh, we got a couple of mechs peeking over. Let's see what that uh, guy there sees. He doesn't see anything. Hmm. <sighs> Interesting. I feel that Warhammer is in trouble then. <laughs> What's the play, eat ass? My god. Well, if they're not there, they're going around Delta 5, possibly through tunnel, because we haven't spotted anything except their light yet. Our, our one guy over here is dead. New target acquired. Get back over on this side. Got a good hit into that Hellbringer. Target acquired. We got about four or five mechs up top. We got some incoming missile. And that's okay. We'll be fine. We're going to hold the... Oh, I can't shoot. God damn, that guy's in front of me. Hit that Arctic Cheetah on the run. Put that shot into his back. That is good for us. Uh, we're going to take out that UAV real quick here. Nope, oh, somebody else did. Thank you. And there just seems to be a mob of people there that I'm just going to put some shots into. We're going to try to push forward as hard as we can while still doing some good damage out there. Don't want to be too far from the ridge line here because we still want to have the ability to fall back if required. But dudes, now you're, tr you're trading with a dual Goss. This is not correct, especially not with medium pulse at this range. You want to push up a little bit closer. Now you're doing it right, Mr. Evan Jaguar. Yes! I nicked something there on that guy. I took some piece of him off, but we have AMS that is covering our ass from these missiles so much. It is amazing. We do, we are down a guy, although I feel like my trades have been going extremely well. And I've definitely gotten my 100 match score so far. So I don't really care if we win or lose this match anymore. For now, I've just done more than enough damage to get me uh, into the consideration for this match. Uh, we can only really throw our Goss rounds out down there because if there is any closer, like this guy, just any closer than that, and I would not be able to uh, use my torso weapons on him. We are crit damage. Gonna back off here, or do a little jump snipes, maybe. Now ah, that one was missed. But fortunately, we have more than enough ammo in order to basically just throw rounds down range and not care, because we have like 56 shots still. It is too much ammo, really. If you're going to be doing this build, you can do other stuff with that. Additional heat sinks, additional targeted computer sizes. I only have the one TC in the center torso uh, to give that, that little bit of a boost. But I like having lots of ammo because then I can just shoot forever. And I can take snapshots like that and not worry that I'm just not going to have enough ammo in the future. Oh, yeah! Oh, oh, oh. That was who got him! He got caught on that damn post, and that killed him. That little catch-up killed him. I was able to put the shot in downrange before he got around that post. And we got another kill on the opponents. Unfortunately, we're open right now, which is bad, but we have been spreading our damage fairly well. So, boom, got a good shot to this guy. His medium lasers are gone, so he's only got a streak too. It's not that much of a problem. We're just going to let somebody else take care of him. He is targeting. Oh, we got our artillery coming in, or strikes. We're going to back off from that. Come on, kill this little guy. There, he's dead. We are 3 2. We're actually winning this ever so slightly. 4 2. Marauder, both side torsos. He's down. Excellent. I did a little bit of damage to my ally there. It wasn't intentional. But they are pushing at us. And we're just putting that damage down as we fall back. 
Oh god, the damage. It hurts. Take that guy's arm off. Get rid of some of his weaponry. Go. Die, you rotaries. Die, you rotaries. Boom, you're dead. Oh, I'm still alive. Somehow, I'm still alive at 29%. This is a ridiculous match. We'll go for the shot here. Boom, right into the CT. Ah, again, sorry, Mr. Catapult. He jumped in front of me a couple times there. Go for that jump shot and get it! Oh, you from downtown! Oh, shit. I could die here. So close to dead, but I'm still alive somehow. That Kodiak is the last one. We gotta have the balls to try to go for the last shot. Ah, no, I'm not gonna get it. Recycle time isn't fast enough. I couldn't get that last kill. We managed to survive. Freaking 20% on the night shift. This is ridiculous. 20%. We did 935 damage done. 3 kills, 9 assists, 3 kill most damage delts. We did 17 team damage. I'm super sorry to that catapult. I shot you in the arms a few times. We did 323,000 singles earned. Oh, this is amazing. And for our last match, we are on Canyon Network Skirmish. And I'm actually really lucky there. You might have a bit more of an abrupt transition than I normally do from the last match in this match is that it, my computer froze and I just barely managed to save the recordings and I just I had to like reboot and all that kind of stuff. So yeah, very lucky that I didn't miss that match because that last match was amazing. And let's hope we can do this again. And what we got on the enemy team, we've got Bombadil. <laughs> We've got one of the two of No Guts, No Galaxy. Er, back in the cover. Got one shot off there. Good shot. And now we're going to do a little bit of pop tarting, throwing bullets out. And oh, my torso wasn't twisted enough. I hit my torso limit. Wasn't able to twist anymore in the air. And that made me sad. Throw random shots downrange because I can. I've got tons of ammo. Oh, hello. Somebody tickling the left side here. Don't get in my way. Oh, you bushwhacker. Poke that side. I dare you. It's okay, though. We're moving around here. Tickled some legs there. Pop back into cover. I kind of want to get out of here now. I'm not liking this anymore. Evacuate! Evacuate! We're going to run across the gauntlet here. But we're going to do it while putting out some good damage. Enemy UAV over the center. We spotted that. People take it down, take it down. When you spot those things, you've got to call it immediately. We just saw that little speckle of light over top of the center. And that, without an uh, indicator of whose it was, means that it was an enemy's. <laughs> Screw you, little wolfhound. Take that hit. Yeah, that's right. There's a wolfhound on the left flank in C3. Ooh, airstrike coming in. My location. Damn. Yeah, take that. Get out of here, wolfhound. I'm watching you, you piece of shit. Oh! Uh, Foxtrot Huntsman is headshot. He'll go down with one tap. I'm crossing people's lines of fire. I'm so bad. I gotta get out of here, though. I'm in the wrong spot. Oh, God, let me by. I need to get over this right flank here. This is where I want to be my sort of build. I want to be up right there. Escape. Escape to the right. Use those jump jets. Pause that little bit to get that little bit of jump jet fuel back. Throw it a shot there. 
Get that night gear in the back. Take off something, I believe. Get around this corner. Now this is where I want to be. Boom. <laughs> oh god, get back into cover. Let's do some jump sniping from here. We are going to lose this, though. We're 0-4. <laughs> we're, we're, we're losing this, that's for sure. But I feel like I'm going to have enough of a advantage here to put in some good damage. Oh, tickle that face! Yeah. Oh no, he was a CT crit. Wasn't, uh... There is that Huntsman out there that uh, is headshot, although I don't know where he is. Niger G is CT open. New target acquired. Bombadil's down. There, the Foxtrot. That guy. Whenever I see him, I'm going to try to laser and rake across his face. We are coming back here a little bit. Let's poke around this right side. New target acquired. That's it. Come on up. Target acquired. I got some lasers for you. New target acquired. Boom, you're dead. It is possible to win this. Just gotta watch out for those uh, lights coming up on me. He didn't even know I was here. Got taken out. We're winning this. S raking for that head. I want that headshot on this guy. Or a back shot. That works too. Anything on that head, uh, fire starter. I can't see the other guy. Throw out a shot there. We've got this Phoenix Hawk. Come on, keep backing up. Yeah! Yeah! Throw that shot into the end there. Right into his back as he's running away. Oh my god, we were down like four or something like that, and we managed to pull it back. Getting over here was a huge deal, because we had that flank. There were so many people who were dropping from this angle because they thought they were in cover, firing on people over here, but we had full line of fire on the man. Five kills, six assists, 706 damage done. 368,000 C-bills. Holy... Shit, that was fun. That was an intense match, man. Oh, but that is going to be it for this episode. I'm going to continue to grind off camera and try to get some of these matches done as fast as possible. And, uh, yeah, thanks for watching, and good hunting.